Hi. So I got this uh, bamboo charcoal nose and T-zone pack from Nature Public because they're having another 50% off sale because they always have sales. So I've never actually used like a pour strip sort of thing or a pour pack uh, thing for specifically for the nose. So it's a two step process. And step number one is the pore opening toner. And step two is like the um, nose strip thing you would peel off. I already cleansed my face with the Nature Republic Ohm, the first cleansing foam, and then the Nature Republic Forest Garden Argan Cleansing Oil. I'm supposed to take one of these um, nose strips. And there you go. I'm supposed to put it on my nose. I'm supposed to wait 10 to 15 minutes. Um, and so I guess I'll be back in 10 or 15 minutes. Okay, I'm back. Um, I'm gonna take it off now. And there is not really a difference. I mean, if anything, I feel like my pores on my nose are tighter, even though this is technically a pore opening toner. Make my hair. And it comes out really thick, like it's I'm squeezing really hard. I'm gonna put it. Oh, this is really hard. This really reminds me of those volcanic clay pore masks, which this probably is that. But I think it's slightly harder, maybe to make it easier to. Oh shit. Easier to uh, peel. Oh my god. It's getting all stringy. Need a little more. I can't look, it's already peeling away. I can't I can't blend it on. So for this one I have to wait um, until it's completely dry or 10 or 15 minutes or until it's completely dry so I'll, so I'll come back then. Okay, so it's been 10 minutes. I'm gonna peel it off now. Oh god. See, I don't think, see, I don't think I put enough on there. So now it's pe probably gonna peel in like small little patches. We'll try it anyway. Okay guys, that was absolutely ridiculous. I had literally, it took me like five minutes to even scrape off a little bit. I ended up just uh, washing it off with water. So next time I'll probably just wash it off with water or I would use a much thicker layer so um, I can take it off in one go. But um, I immediately noticed that my nose is a lot smoother. Although visually it kind of looks the same. I did notice that around here, where I usually get tiny little dots where I'm assuming that's like my clogged pores, notice there that there's no little white, you know, clogging that's happening anymore. So I'm quite impressed with that. And my nose, my nose is just so smooth. Keep touching it. So after I cleanse my face um, and I do any peel off, wash off masks, then I'll go in with my acid toner. You guys know how much I love acid toning. And I think acid toning is like the key to smooth skin. And I ran out of my favorite Etude House one. So I've just been using the Stridex um, acne control uh, sheets. And I don't really use this for acne control. Although it kind of helps whenever I have a small breakout. I use this more because there are acidic ingredients in here that help exfoliate and smooth out the skin after it dries i neutralize it with either water or i spray a uh, spray mist all right it's dry so i'm going to neutralize it with my innisfree green tea mineral mist or you can just use water 
and then I'm gonna go with my eye cream. I still have my Nature Public the first eye cream. I've had this for like over a year now, almost a year. And I'm about about done. I just have that left. This stuff is super thick, so it's very moisturizing. And if I notice that I'm getting some fine lines under my eyes, I put this on and then the next day they're pretty much gone. This step is where I use serums. If I'm being lazy that day, um, I'll just use an essence because that's that is a serum in like a watery form, but um, I've been using these treatment essences to target specific um, problems with my skin. Um, I got this Uriage Depiderm White Serum Corrector. Um, it's a lightening corrective serum and I got this in Paris. It's kind of a watery, not really watery, but... And this is supposed to target dark spots which I get easily because of my skin is on the paler side. This is Lancome's Visionaire Advanced Skin Correcting Serum. It's supposed to target wrinkles, pores, and, un and unevenness. Unevenness is what I have um, with my acne scarring, like the pitted scarring. This was about $50, I think, the small size. But in the time that I've used this, I've noticed I definitely noticed that my skin is much smoother and the pitted scarring is less obvious. And the last step is um, my moisturizer. I used this Snail Solution 70 cream. I got a bunch of these because they were on sale and I couldn't help it. But um, yeah, I used this. It's thick, but it's like when you rub it in your between your fingers it really thins out and it really balances the mo the levels of moisture and oil on your skin it just really softens the skin and it's at this point that i'll put on like a uh, sheet mask or anything like that but other than that i'm done i hope that was helpful or informal and that was and you enjoyed it so i'll see you in my next video Bye. Thank you.